Rob Baldwin here, IMX Productions and 10 Minute Photoshop. It's 6.30 in the morning, it's pretty early, but let's do a tutorial. So um, let's talk about Photoshop action scripts. Now what's great about action scripts is that a professional graphic designer like myself has done the work for you and all you have to do is click play. So what an action, so a script actually is, is a series of recorded Photoshop steps. So every time there's a brush stroke, every time you click a tool, everything, uh, Photoshop records all that and then you create an action script out of it and then the next person comes along and wants to do the same thing. They just click play and Photoshop virtually replays all those steps and does that action for you. Okay, so let's take a look at one of the action scripts to make an ebook cover. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is install the actions into Photoshop. So if you're downloading an action, what you want to look for is this .atn file right here and that is your Photoshop actions. Um, so what we want to do is pop open Photoshop and come here to the to usually if you have your standard layout next to your history you'll have the actions palette if it's not there simply come up to windows and make sure that actions is clicked open <clears throat> okay come over to the right click the drop down menu and go to load actions dot atn open that and then your action script will be in there usually it'll be within a folder and then right underneath you'll have your action Okay, now some action scripts work um, directly from scratch. You click play and the action will actually open a new uh, canvas and start designing for you, depending on what the designer has done. Uh, for mine, what I've done is I've, I've provided you with a PSD file that already has, you can see, our spiral book here and we're just going to, the action is going to paste your design onto that book. But, I mean, mo most action scripts will give you a text file with instructions of what to do because, you know, they're all different. So, okay, so we've got a couple, you know, here's a, um, a logo design for one of my ebooks. So let's take this and let's drag this onto our uh, book cover. Now make sure that it's in the appropriate layer folder. All these instructions are um, are given with, with the text file included, okay? So literally all I've done design-wise is open this file and then my my book design that I've done, I've dragged it onto it, put it in the, pr the proper place. I can actually close this now, I don't need this anymore. All we, whoop, all we need is this file here, which has the same spi angle one spiral. I've got my action script angle one spiral, and watch this, this is real time, this is not sped up. I click play, boom, just like that. Literally two seconds, we've got our book cover. So as you can see, in literally seconds, we just uploaded the action script, popped in our design, clicked play, and that was it. 3D uh, book cover, just like that. If you want to check out a lot more of these, there's over 35 action scripts that I've done on my site. Check that out. Click the link below and go check those out. Alright, um, this is Rob Baldwin. Thanks for watching. Have an awesome day.